Hello, and welcome to another Behind the Gingers track. This week, well, this episode, I'm going to take you behind the scenes of my new single, which is another one with Lewis Meza uh, from Mexico. Uh, this one is called Cosmic Rest Face. That was my Cosmic Rest Face. I'm sure I can do better, you know. I'll keep trying. And um, yeah, so let's jump in. I'll show you what, what I did. So again, Lewis sent me this as a demo for 1980 recordings, and I decided it needed a better arrangement, needed something else, needed beefing like beefed up. Uh, so yeah, so I took his parts and then added bits and rearranged and produced it basically. So I will show you his original parts. If we go there, 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 there. No. That's not his. That's not his. Uh, the rides aren't his. Yeah. So this is his original part. Which is all nice. But then I added a bit more percussion and some rides and I added the kick. lifts it a bit as you can see it just lifts it a bit sorry i'll try it i always forget i've got to stop it and then talk to you because uh, i'll just be shouting um yeah and then so basically then we had this groove but then his went i cut some out here and as you can see i've cut some out here and then i really like this bit so I doubled it and then changed it for a final breakdown then and then kept moving bits around and added more bits where he didn't have them. So it added more energy, etc. So then, yeah. And then obviously I produced it, uh, which I do a lot. I use the, I use the glue a lot, which is this compressor. Uh, ever since I saw Chris Lake use it in, God, when? 2011, maybe? I love it. It's great. It's because you can mix you can mix it. As you can see, you mix in, like, the original signal to the process signal. Uh, channel EQs. I've actually stopped using this channel EQ, and I, and I now use this one. So any new productions has got this on because it's such a good uh, EQ, the FabFilter Pro Q3. Um... And then I use the WAVs H compressor as a sidechain. So as you can see, it, it ticks along. And you can sidechain it to any audio you want. Um, and yeah. I didn't I didn't use that many UADs on this one. I used the some UAD on the uh, Vox, which is a limiter, inflator. A delay, which is really cool, the cog delay. And the Neve compressor. Compressor EQ sort of thing. Um yeah, so that's it really. Uh I just tried to keep it simple because he'd already processed some stuff. So I didn't want to over process it. So I just beefed it I just beefed it up a bit. And then you have this. So I will start it from here. So you can you can hear what we've done, uh, what, what the track is all about, and it's all available on Spotify, Deezer, Apple Music, um, Beatport, Track Source, all of the above and more. Yeah, my links in the bio somewhere, or just search Dan Mackay and Lewis Meza, Cosmic Rest Face on Thirty Three Music. <laughs>
that sound is this. So you've got that echoey sound, and then you've got the arpeggio. Rise. And then you've got the bass, which you probably can't hear on all the socials because you'll be listening to it on your phone. happening. Well, all don't. Let's have a look. Yeah, not that much automation actually. No, no automation on this one. So I must have liked his bits and then just rearranged them and he had them already automating so I didn't need to. But as you can see I have I have sort of faded some bits as you can see there. Which is all I needed to do, because the demo was great, but it just me needed that extra oomph, and hopefully, I brought it. So there you go. So yeah, then we'll carry on. So. I added this bit because it went well with this. It's like a Balearic sort of diddle diddle, bam 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 diddle diddle. So that's Dan Mackay and Lewis Meza, Cosmic Rest Face, on 33 Music. Go stream or buy it now. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, leave a comment. If you don't, just leave a like. All helps. Thank you very much.